Um, am I gonna be? Yo, I am gonna be getting shot at. Okay, I thought they ran off. Stay the fuck down. Jesus Christ, there's a lot of them. I only have a, I only have a pistol. Fuck oh. off, you confused piece of shit. So, who are your? Oh, that sucks. Oh, I'm just Trevor. God damn it. No, no, no. Get the one right in front of your face shooting you in the goddamn mouth. You're on ice, prick. Oh, I'm not making. Why is he on fire? How are you not dead? I hate that. <clears throat> I hate being able to shoot him four times in the face and they're still alive. Oh, God. No, no, no. The one in front of you. We could have teamed up. Let me reload. I'm just watching the door. There's only three left. Hey, go fuck yourself! I don't know why Trevor threw his gun. Why do they think we're boyfriends? A couple more just showed up. There wasn't like three left on the map. Reload. Hey, this is back to the typical Grand Theft Auto. Find a good spot, hold up, poke your head out. Hey, can we do this where the weather's better? Take a few shots. You should have gone after the other guy. You think Trevor would have been any better? Oh, this spot's good. There we go, headshot. I'm about killed all of you. You're aware of that, right? Oh, nope, two more showed up. <clears throat> wonder if this is one of those endless wave things. That would suck, because <clears throat> I would run out of ammo. Ah, you want a boyfriend, huh? Oh, they, yeah, they keep yelling for backup. I think this is one of those endless wave things. He won't abandon his same-sex partner. Good God, like 30 of them. Fuck off, you confused pieces of sh Headshot. Shit. You're screwed. I don't see anyone. Fuck off! Hey, guys! You ever heard of overkill? How? You don't just take four bullets to the chest, oh, hey, and off. then a fifth bullet to the chest, and then stand up. To the car! Yeah, I'm pretty sure those waves are unlimited. You're making a mistake. Neat jump, Michael. Real good. That's weird how that fence is bent the other way and you still can't get over it. <clears throat> okay, so I'm back up here. I'll tell you about my attempts as soon as I can... As soon as I can do this. I still think there are unlimited enemies. At least until you hit a certain checkpoint, I think the enemies are unlimited. Okay, I've cleared them all now. That's the thing. They're all fucking gone. Where the fuck is my car? Oh, okay. And another van. <laughs> okay. Okay, I finally made it to the cars. Thank God. That's at least gonna set a checkpoint. Trevor. I fuck! Shit. You got nowhere to go, boyfriend. Alright, alright. I just killed like half your army. That's gonna be interesting. Yeah, basically when I cut, what I tried doing, because I thought the waves were endless, I would sprint forward, and I would actually get pretty close to the car most of the time, but I never actually made it, so I decided to slow down and try it again. And it didn't take me too long. You just gotta pick and choose when you go. It It's gonna make you... Um, he's probably gonna make a phone call or something, but it's gonna make you uh, wait. You have to wait at spots, wait until it's pretty clear, uh, run, run ahead, wait at another spot, wait till it's pretty clear, run ahead to the church, wait till it's pretty clear, and then you can go to the car like I did. But if you just stay at one spot forever, it's going to be unlimited. Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao. Yeah, the ex-nut. Backed out of a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. My friends miss you in North Yankton. I was hoping we could talk. Ah, <laughs> was that your people? Ah, oh, of course. Sorry I had to cut God. out. 
Your operation causes problem for me. I want to expand into Blaine County, but your business and your temperament prevent me from making inroads. Huh, well, too bad. I don't know what you can do about that. I've already done something. We have your lover. Whoa, 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 whoa. My lover? Michael DeSanta. You live in your trailer together with the maid. And then you were alone in that big house. Well, you're clearly very close. You know, how much will you give up for his safety? <laughs> My lover! Yeah, right! It's a tough break. I never want to double-cross a friend and put him in danger, but you gotta do what you gotta do. My business ain't going anywhere. I'm serious about this. He will die. Tell him. I love him, dear. Damn, Trevor. It's cold. He just didn't give a shit. He's like, bye, Michael. Which I guess after the events that just transpired, you might be inclined to do the same yourself. And then you have to put Trevor's psychotic asshole mind into play, so. Let's see if I can land this. Me and Frank on roll. Oh, no, that might. Oh, no, that's Lamar. That's not. I read that and not. Oh, that's not how you landed? Oh, I'm gonna blow up. God damn it. This is gonna make me make a whole flight over again. Well, let's try to hit this landing strip without fucking killing ourselves. What do you say? Oh, that was actually pretty graceful, if I do say so myself. If I would stop fucking gliding, I'm gonna have to run so far. Fuck it. What? Because I landed on my feet. The plane blew up. Hilarious how the plane blew up, even though it was skidding just fine at a slow, graceful pace on the ground. I'll see you when I get the fuck back. Trevor Phillips Industries. Mr. Phillips, this is Wei Chang. You know my eldest son, Tao. Oh, yeah. Massive E head. Backed out a contract we agreed on. How is he? Still learning the ropes, thank you. We've been watching you, Phillips. Your operations causes problems with our plans for expansion. And since you're not a viable business partner... Oh, viable? What the fuck is that? We have your lover, Phillips. From the trailer. My lover? Yes, Michael DeSanta. You live with him with your maid. He's in our custody now. Give yourself up, and he will live. <laughs> okay. All right, yeah, yeah, no, of course, man, that's a, that's a tough break. I, look, you guys deserve each other. Hold on to that fat traitor and feel free to torture him to your heart's content. You'll save me the trouble. I'm gonna leave that part in just because it's different dialogue and it's neat and for some reason it wants to autosave now. But yeah, different dialogue, so hey, at least... I mean, you know, you got to see something most people probably don't get to see, the alternate dialogue. For me, sucking at this game, I've died way too much this session so far. But, yeah. I'm actually going to read this text, and then I should be prompt to land. This is Lamar. That's not... I keep thinking that's Wade for some reason. Hey, crazy man, meet me at my crib. Me and Frank going to roll that last car for the rich dude. You in? I don't know. Not if I don't have to be. Okay, so let's try this again. I still, I literally, on my way over here before I got the phone call, I pushed all the buttons, could not figure out how to do uh, landing gear at all, so let's just hope I don't run out of runway. What do you say about that? Oh, dear God, this is not going to be pretty. Can you tell how not pretty this is going to be? First of all, I'm going to miss the fucking landing strip. Okay. Alright. Stop doing that! What the fuck? Okay, I think I just figured out. Yeah, there's the button. You gotta click L3. That's the only button on the fucking controller I swear I didn't push earlier. I thought I did. Let's hope this time I don't fuck everything up again. Because it's just so fun flying over this thing. You're in the same phone conversation over and over. Well, I guess it was different the second time. I didn't even... I just didn't even talk to him the third time. I just hung up, but... 
Yeah, I'm seeing the same shit. It'd be different if this plane flew a little faster, I guess, but you just feel like you're moving at the pace of ass, so. Straighten it out, pull up. Bang. And I think we're good. I'm gonna actually go forward a little bit. It takes a little while. Oh, hey. Oh, this counts? Well, go fuck yourself. A moment of truth. Well, what's next? There's a big D. That's a Trevor mission. Let's go there. I don't think I have a parachute. Let's not go there. I might have a parachute. Let's go there. If I don't have a parachute, I'll find another way. I'll find other means. But for now, I think the I think I keep the parachute like permanently. I'm pretty sure. Don't quote me on that. We'll find out. We'll find out when I come up here because I know I already have a parachute. That's not a thing. Let's go ahead and put that back up. I think that messes with you when you fly. That's so cool. I finally figured out how to do that. Thank God. Figured this would be the quickest way over to the Big D mission. That's Devin. Oh, that's that Devin dude that he's going to hate now, too, because Devin was in cahoots with Michael about the whole thing. So, yeah. I don't know. It, ta it takes it takes me a little bit to get back into the flow when I fuck up that many times, and I've died way too many times for this session. Uh, granted, it's true. Granted, I thought it was getting a little harder, but I shouldn't have died. That was kind of like random BS when I died. Uh, trying to get over to the airport. One of them was my own fault. I punched someone in an airport. And you, apparently, if you punch someone in an airport, even if it's by accident, you will get shot by 90,000 police officers in the next four seconds. And you will be shot multiple times until well after you stop moving. So don't do that if you're in an airport. Don't accidentally hit anybody. Um, and then one time I, I flew the ramp, the side uh, barricade didn't hold me up. So that was kind of random BS. And then as Michael. Uh, that was a really weird mission. I mean, r how how often do you see infinite spawns in Grand Theft Auto? I mean, I don't remember a time when... I'm, I'm almost guaranteed it didn't happen in GTA 4. There was never just an infinite group of people coming at you, but... You never know. So this whole session's kind of weird. And then, of course, they're trying to make the game harder. I get that, and I get that they're trying to make everything harder. Being that I'm pretty sure we're nearing the end of the game here. But... Do we have a parachute? Hell yeah, we do. That's good. Just try to get me over here. I probably pulled that a little early. But I'm glad. I don't think it does that in online mode, but story mode, it's really cool that it, uh... Die bomb. In story mode, it's really cool that it... Why do I have the cops on me? Okay, he's gone now. I don't fully understand. Pull up, Trevor. Pull up, pull up. I don't fully understand why I have one star unless my plane crashed into somebody or somebody's house or something. Oh, this alleyway looks nice. Let's land here. Oh, shoot, got tangled. Good thing I landed on the soft parachute. No, 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 come on. We gotta move, Trevor. We gotta move. Trevor, Trevor, we gotta move. All right, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna take cover here because I've been, I've had them lost for a little while now, so. It shouldn't be too long before they give up. And if they don't give up, they'll have some kind of fate to accept. It'll be on their hands, though. It'll be 100% their fault. I won't even feel bad. Let's come over here. Because if they come around that corner, it'll take them a little bit to see us. I'm pretty sure they're about... Yeah, there we go. Alright, that's not bad. Maybe you can't parachute in town. I don't know. That was weird that I got the cops on me right there. This whole, this whole session's been kind of weird, but... If we're lucky, it's about to straighten itself out, because this mission should be pretty damn awesome. I probably shouldn't run through town with a minigun out, or a yeah, submachine gun out, I should say, but... Oh well, too late. Lamar Davis, what's up? I'm part of the team. That's what's up. Team? I don't do teams. Uh, Devin Weston's car still in team? The one Frank's running. Oh, oh yeah, that one. Hey, look, I boosted the ride. I'm about to meet your boy Franklin, and I need your ass to pick up the Packer, meet us outside the garage, and we taking these motherfuckers up to Bolito Bay. All right, buddy. Fine. That's a long trip. Yay, a long trip. I'm gonna be Franklin for a little bit of it, so that's all good. Long driving trips just increase the possibility of me ramming into another car head first, but I have fun driving in this game. Let's go collect the car. The music it leaves me with sometimes when I very first start is just, it's funny to me. 
I feel like I haven't been in Franklin's beast of a car in forever. After I tricked it out, I could probably go back now and trick it out even more. Just make it faster and give it better armor and stuff. Better armor. Pretty sure it's already got bulletproof tires. It looks sweet as shit still. And the smoke, it burns out. It uh, burns out blue. Shit! Barely a scratch on the beast. That's okay, we're about to switch cars anyway, so it's... Fuck you. I know that was completely my fault, but fuck that guy. Um, yeah, barely a scratch on the old beast, so let's get on in here. Where the fuck am I going? Obviously, that pole isn't the answer. That's not why. Oh, is this it? Sweet. He over at the usual place. Talking about a pilot's license. I think they're doing advertising for stuff in the game. In the game, that's kind of neat, I guess. I feel like that's been in Grand Theft Autos before, but I just. The boost, homie. How did it go? Any problem? You know me, fool. Yeah, I do know you, fool. So what you think? Smooth as silk. I'm thinking where the blood stains and the bullet holes and shit. Man, fuck. That amateur shit behind me. I'm a professional now, like you and them old dudes. So tell me what happened. I saw the ride. I took the ride. No drama. No security. No one saying, who the fuck is this gangly motherfucker doing in my car? Nothing. That's worrying, man. Be careful. Line it up on the truck. Yeah, you're a little late yes, for that he one. he is, homie. We straight. Boss man's happy. Then we'll get moving. Man, this old bust-ass nigga ain't no boss. Enough, nigga. Get your ass right. in the truck. Let's go. Oh, so you got to scooch in. It's funny. Sonora Freeway. Pass oh, these Lake. are all the cars I've stolen. Look at that. That's cool. The old Batmobile-looking one, the cool orange one, the cool-looking blue one. Yeah, this is pretty sweet. The very rare Z gray one on the top back. Hey, it's, uh... Cozy in here. Scooch up, homie. Yeah. Scooch over here. Scooching in that crazy dude? Oh, hell no. That nigga stank. Get over here. I don't bite. That ain't what I heard. All cannibalistic and shit. Frank, what you been telling him? I say what? I see, homie. You dig on man me. Ah, uh, rumor and hearsay. We got a long way to go. I'd get comfortable. All right, nigga, but don't try nothing. How far is it? In this thing? About four hours. Shit. It's your operation, Slick. Shit, if you all right driving, I'm going to catch up on some sleep. Go for it. It's all right being the boss. Meant to be running things, but this fool sleep. Yeah, I'll be asleep when your ass stop talking, nigga. Some boss. He wasn't joking. Like, he, well, he was when he said four hours, but 